shot. That is a huge bass. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God, dude. Holy crap. Biggest bass I've ever caught. Biggest bass I've ever caught. Dude, that was the biggest bass I've ever hooked in my entire life. On the secret lake? <laughs> I'm still shaking. <laughs> oh, this is a bumpy road. Uh, well, guys, I'm actually really excited about today. Today, I'm doing something a little bit different that I think is going to be really exciting. And something that I think is going to help me out a lot up here in North Florida. I am literally surrounded by hundreds of these small lakes and ponds. And every one of them has incredible potential to be an absolute trophy hole. The problem is trying to get onto those lakes is near impossible. Any extra chance I got, I'm driving around, opening up Google Maps and finding lakes, but I still gotta drive around that lake and find out if I even have access to it. 99% of the time, there's no access. People live on those lakes and that's the only access is through their yards. But I found a brand new hack. I found a way that I can save myself a bunch of time by just opening up this one simple app. And some everybody's already done the work for me. Almost every single body of water out here, every single lake, somebody has used this app and told me what kind of fish you're catching out of there. If it's a good fishery or not, and even better, they've actually marked out the lakes that have ramps and public access to it. I don't have to drive around for hours checking out all these lakes anymore. I can actually just open up an app, quickly scan through the map, pick one, see what they're catching, where they're catching them, and even what they're catching them on. It even tells me what the best times of day to go check it out. I've got insider info, intel, intel, intel. This is flipping awesome. So what is this amazing hack that I found? It's a free app. It's called Fish Brain. There's a whole bunch in this, guys. When you first log in and make your profile on this app, it's gonna tell you to pick your region or your zone. So every time any user catches a fish, you post where you caught it, it's gonna show me the feed of all those lakes in that range that I've already selected. But this guy caught a largemouth bass casting on Camilla Lake. Here's some of the latest catches that people have logged on Camilla Lake. Largemouth, largemouth, a lot of fish. This looks like a good place to investigate. Where is Camilla Lake? Plus catch positions. It's going to show me on this map exactly where this Camilla Lake is. If I zoom in on these catches, there's a little lake right there that I had no idea is there. It's actually even showing me on the lake where they caught those catches. So now I found a new lake. I know that they're catching bass on here. And this is just from the feed. I hit this map button and here it is. It's going to open up the map. Look at all these other blue dots. Every one of those blue dots is another lake, another catch. And check it out. All these orange dots, there's a little boat there because that's a boat ramp. That's telling me that that little pond, that little lake has a boat ramp on it. This app will save me a ton of time. But now that I know this one has a boat ramp here, I can actually go in and check it out. That is a nice bass. He even tells me what he caught it with. Spartacus Baitcaster, he caught that with a Cast King Baitcaster. I like this guy. And he used a mag, mag worm. They tell me where they caught it, what they caught it on. This is just fantastic. Another cool, cool topic here, gear. Everything that we want from baits, lures, rods, reels, lines, terminal tackle, and they've got everything in here. You're gonna be pretty hard pressed to find a lure that you can't find on this Fish Brain app. This thing is completely detailed shows you the ratings and the rankings on it and even reviews the only thing this thing's not doing is telling me exactly when to fish right forecast what is that is the weather forecast air pressure sun and moon phase tides but look at this bite time for fish for a largemouth bass the bite time the best time but that's that's tomorrow that's tomorrow's forecast here's sunday's forecast that is pretty cool it forecasts the best times. This is a very detailed app. This is really cool. And it's just gonna get better. The more people that get on this app, the more people that input information, 
the better it's, it's going to get. It's just going to get better and better. What a fantastic, cool app. But right now, for today, Fish Brain found me a new lake that I have access to that I've never fished before. And we're going to see if this brand new hack, this new to me hack, can catch us some fish. A lot of times you're going to have to make a believer out of me. So I'm going to actually put it to the test right now. Using the Fish Brain app, I found a little lake. Really juicy looking lake. On Fish Brain, it says it actually has a boat ramp. A public boat ramp, of all things. And I'm a bit skeptical. People are gonna mislead you on, on things like this. So they may say they're in one place when they were really in another place. But let's face it, most of us fishermen, we're liars. We wanna protect our little secrets. So can this app actually truly guide me to a brand new honey hole so i'm on my way right now i don't know if it's deep enough to get my boat in there or if i have to pull out a kayak or the roundabout i might as well go get a coffee and check it out firsthand we're here that is definitely a boat ramp it's even got a big cement dock they wouldn't build a ramp like this if there wasn't at one point some really good reason to be here oh <gasps> What did we find? There's a couple homes out here with docks. Look at the cover. We got pads, we got grasses, we got submerged trees. I don't know, is this thing safe to be walking on? But it actually looks like it gets pretty deep. And when I look at the map, this place is not just what I'm seeing here. It's huge, it goes way back in there. There is no doubt in my mind, there is bass in here and a lot of them. There's definitely fish in here. But what do I want to bring? Ho oh, ho, Nelly. All right, so after going out here yesterday, I just wasn't sure what I wanted to do as far as a boat out here. Decided the best boat to bring out of my roundabout and my boat was Ted's boat. There and Ted's here. I couldn't keep it a secret. This place is just so awesome. It looks so juicy. And his boat is a little smaller than mine. So We're here. We're out here now. We're gonna figure out how to get this boat, try to get in the water and see what is out there. Did Fish Brain app find a brand new secret honey hole full of big bass? The boat's in the water, we did it. It turns out it's only really, really shallow right here at the boat ramp, but this is awesome. Ted, what do you think about this so far? It's pretty good. It does look pretty juicy. I hear fish popping already. Oh man, this is awesome. Let's find out if Fish Brain app can actually help you find a new fishing honey hole. That's pretty neat back here. I like it. Yeah, once we got back here, definitely the water's clearer back here. Yeah, I hear bluegill and stuff popping. Really? Yeah. Oh. Something wake me. I had a wake come out for sure. Holy oh, crap, we caught a fish! There was an actual bass in here. We've had a heck of a time, but there was a bass. <laughs> Little dude. Oh yeah. Good doggy, we got him. This little pod just got bass. Hey, fish brain didn't say it was gonna catch me a ton of big fish. Just it just said it was gonna get, find, help me find fish. Or at least that's all you said. We found fish, <laughs> but we're Step one. we might just be getting started though. That's what I say. We're just getting warmed up. We finally figured it out. That's two fish in like two seconds. Yeah, in less than a minute. Yeah, so 
It just took us a long time to figure out that pattern, that's all. <laughs> well, the one guy that logged the catch said he used a worm. Yeah. It didn't didn't say we're on this pond. He was just on this lake. No, where did you? Another one? Yeah. Definitely looks better. Yeah. Oh, he's not that big, but he's better. Just like the right here, another one. They're right in front of this grass. <laughs> this is one little patch. You know, sometimes you can cover like you know, half a mile of a bank and you go, wow, I only caught two fish on that whole entire half mile. But really, when you think about it, you caught both those fish within like a 50 yard section. Even though it all looks the same, like you go back and cover that whole half mile stretch, you may not catch another fish until you hit that same 50 yards again. All right, so we didn't catch anything. We had a couple bites, we didn't catch anything all along there until we get to this little section right here. And that's three fish in like two minutes. I don't know why, but this spot is holding better than anywhere else. Oh, it broke off. And one, it broke off. Not a good knot. That's not good. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> oh, loser. Oh! Got off. I had him. Definitely had him. Yeah, we just lost three fish, all right in the Maybe same the reason, spot. One of them is the same thing. You're, you're, the one you had hooked looked big. Yeah, was, oh, your rod was bent pretty good anyway. Nope, pretty good. It's definitely the best one today. Oh. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he came out of the water for it. <laughs> Didn't get it though, he got the tail and pulled it down. Right in that hole. Yeah. Hey, we're finding fish out here in the lake. Yeah. Someone on this pond placed a little marker out there. Why not fish it? There he is off a neg. You got that on a swim jig. I'm just tossing a net rig down there. Best one yet today? Yeah. Ooh. He hit it pretty good. He wasn't huge, but bigger than anything else I had. Wrecked my little big easy. There you go. Frog bite. Got one on the froggy. My, it just disappeared. There was no bite. It just no? <laughs> was gone. Came up right behind it. It. We figured it out, man. New lake, new to us. Just using some of the techniques that we normally would use. And you know what? There's a reason there was a ramp on this lake. Point, yeah. yeah, there's fish in here, but nonetheless, found it because of that app, and it's, we've got some fish so far. I think we're just getting started. I think we're gonna get quite a few more. Came out here in like one of the hardest parts of the day to to catch fish anyway middle of the afternoon 90 something degrees oh buddy if i got him he's i think he's wrapped up but i don't think he's small You see my bait? Yeah. Oh. Damn it. He wasn't small. Yeah. That was definitely the biggest fish today. Damn. It's too bad. Here we got one. <laughs> On the worm. 
Oh, there's a little guy. There little guy, but he's chunky. Chunky, chunky little dude. I won't complain, though. I'll take it. Got him. <laughs> Little dude. Hey, 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 hey. I thought he was running with it. And when they swim away with it like that, like, where are you going? <laughs> you know, when they run with it, it's usually a smaller one that can't get the whole thing in his mouth. So he's taken off so the other ones can't try to steal it from him. There it is. A little better. A little bit. Yeah, that. that. Been eating, boy. There it is. Gotta be the best one so far today. Dude, we, we haven't done that bad for a lake we never fished before that we just found. How many is that? I don't even know. That's quite a few. Anyway, we'll, I'm sure we'll get a few more. Yeah, it's just now. Oh. See that? Just to try, you know. Did you see that? Yeah. Might have been gar. Almost looked like a long nose, didn't it? Yeah. I don't know what it is, but it wants it. I didn't get him. He got my big easy though. He did? He got it. <laughs> he said he wanted it. What the <laughs> Christ? <laughs> Man, three times he hit it. I was like, yeah, he wants it though. Yeah, he did. He took it. Traded it in a split, a split second. Blake and I traded it for a handful of weed. Nice freaking guy. There you go. Little frog bass. Yeah. Oh my God. Did you get him? Yeah, that is a huge bass. It sure sounded like it. Dude, it jumped out of the water. You sure you got him? Yeah, I got him. Oh my god, dude. Holy crap. It's the biggest bass I've ever caught. Biggest bass I've ever caught. You keep you keep your line tight on him. Don't worry, I'll get him. I got it, I got it. Where is it? He's there. I can still feel him. Your frog's right there, dude. It's gone. He's gone. Oh, oh yeah, he's gone. Son of a bitch. That was a big fish. Did you see it? I saw parts of it. Dude. Yeah. Yeah, she tied a frog on. <laughs> that was the biggest bass I've ever hooked in my entire life. On the secret lake? <laughs> sounded big and I saw a little flops. It came out of the water. Like shamooed. I'm shaking, dude. Like it was there until we got over here. And then it got in the pads. And that was considerably bigger than my 10 pounder holy crap dude on a frog well man that was a ton of fun anytime you can get onto a new lake that you've never never been on before well that's just a great thing
had to work it pretty hard today to figure it out. But I really do think we actually stumbled across a pretty great little spot here. But I definitely see the potential. I mean, how can you not? There's definitely some big ones, and I'm definitely calling back. We would never have found this place or would never known we could have gotten to this place onto this lake if it wasn't for the Fish Brain app. Pretty cool thing, guys. You got to check it out. Maybe it'll help you find a new fishing hole. But nonetheless, it could definitely help you be a better angler on the holes you already have. Check it out, Fish Brain app. I'll leave links down in the description down below. There's so much more, I haven't even touched it. I just started playing with this thing. The more people that get on the app, the better it's gonna be. Pretty cool thing, keeps us all in tune, all in touch, I like it. I was really skeptical at first, but I can't deny that I, it actually helped me out and actually did prove to be a very useful hack out there. Well guys, I really hope you enjoyed this and I hope you learned a little something. If you did, make sure you smash the heck out of that like button. And leave a comment for me on anything else you'd like to see me film or try. I'll do my very best to make a video out of each and every one of those. But most importantly, guys, subscribe to the channel. And stay subscribed. Because there's plenty more coming in Sawgrass Bass's future. One last time, guys, from beautiful North Florida. Found me a new hack. It's a fishing app. And it found me a new fishing hole. I'm Captain Mikey, signing out. The future is bright. You keep those lines tight.